lang namin dito sa Bangkal Port, located in Carles Iloilo, which is a three-hour drive from the city proper of Iloilo. Hi! Day 2! On the way sa Bangka. Around 9 a.m., tinawag na yung batch ano? namin para sumakay na sa Bangka. Unang-una sa lahat, ang init noon. Pangalawa, ang hangin. Ang galin mo to, Lili, pa rin yan. Una lang naming napansin is walang bubong yung boat, yung bangka. Pero eventually naman, after namin makarating dun sa first island, nilagyan na rin nila kuya ng cover. For your Isas de Gigantes trip pala, you'll be visiting five islands in total, starting off with the Southie Island or the Kabugao Gumay Island. Yeah. More than one hour kami sa boat ride. This is Kabugao Gamay Island. After one hour of boat ride, we finally arrived here at Kabugao Gamay so, Island. So, una, akit tayo dito. Once nakaakit kayo dito sa taas kung saan nagpipicture, may kita nyo talaga yung overlooking view. And now I understand why this place is really a must visit in Iloilo. After taking photos at the top, you can even ask help from your tour guide to take pictures of you and your friends. After that, we're now on our way to our second destination which is the floating sandbar. Malakas yung alon, kaya halos lahat kami nabasa. So I wouldn't recommend for you to bring your phone. If ever you have a GoPro, it's best na you bring it here na lang sa sandbar. After taking photos, we're now going back to the boat to our next destination which is at Antonia Island. Out of all the islands you'll visit, it is in Antonia Island that you're able to do snorkeling and also swimming. Now we're on our way to go swimming and yung daladala ko lang dito is goggles that you can rent for 100 pesos each. Slow down, hold on tight now, it's okay to meet me at the front line Before leaving, bumili lang din kami ng mais con yellow for 100 pesos. We are now on the way to our next destination which is in Tante Lagoon. Struggle. Going down the lagoon is a bit of a struggle so make sure to take care of yourself when going down. Uh, it's so pretty yeah. I think pwede din kayong mag diving or mag cliff diving dito pero since we are pressed for time we just took photos here. <laughs> Feeling ko mas na-appreciate ko ito kasi dun sa pinakauna natin pinuntahan. Ah, oh, lagoon to baby. Finally, it's time for lunch and we're very excited to try out the unlimited scallops and other seafood prepared for us. Dito na kami sa lunch place. Actually, parang 2.30 na ata. Ay, nin pa lang kami magla-lunch. And, andun pa yung boat. Kailangan mag-walk. Ay, ano gagawin? Ang mapakang pintalo. Ay, ang bait. Sorry, nag-vlog ako. Lunch. Very chicken for the allergic and After this, we visited one more island, but then I wasn't able to take videos. Now we had a three hour drive going back to our hotel. Day three. Huh? Today is day 3. And Last day. Ayoko na. Charot. <laughs> <laughs> On the way kami Gimaras. And itong bag yung kami sa expander. Wait lang. Pwede pa kawak muna sa trip. Kahit medyo inaantok pa, we're now on our way to Jordan Gimaras. Hindi pa kami nagbe-breakfast and sakto nakita namin si Kuya nagbabenta ng donut kaya bumili kami for I think 15 pesos each. After 15 minutes, we're here sa terminal. Uh, Our first destination is San Lorenzo Wind Farm located in San Lorenzo, Guimaras. Overall, there are 27 wind turbines in this wind farm that can generate 2 megawatts of power each. Sobrang sarap ng hangin. We are here at the pit stop restaurant. Nagtatry namin tong mango pizza. Parang homemade pizza. Ito masarap naman. Ang laka! Ano? Lasa? Lasang lasa pizza. 
lots of pizza. Mango spaghetti. Oh, tikman nyo na. Sarap. What I love about Gimaras is they like to make everything with mango, so tinry din naman yung adobo with mango and sisig with mango. One, two, three, go! Ah, so cute! Of course, we won't forget the mango shake. There's a mango plantation. I'm going to go there! I'm going to go there! Look! Look! Oh my god! That's good! It's hot and hot in the hot and hot. It's a hot mango shake. And it's so good, guys. Where is it? Where is it? Next, we're going to go to the Trappist Monastery. Our next destination is in Gisi Lighthouse. This lighthouse dates back to the 18th century, built beside the Gisi Beach. It's almost 3 p.m. Ito na kami sa may beach. 20 pesos or 10 pesos per pack for one hour. Ito pa, ang ganda. Kita mo na, pwede naman na. So, pwede ipabox, pwede yung plastic. And, ang laki ng mangga. Our last destination is this man-made forest. As usual, we just took some TikTok videos and pictures. And after that, for some reason, parang bigla lang nagkatakutan. <laughs> Uy! <laughs> What? Before we ended today, we just played with cards. And actually, it's already 1 a.m. But we didn't mind since we didn't have a long flight the next day. Then we just requested from our tour guide that we went to the Pasalubong Center. And then we just bought food before our flight. For Manila, all the guests for this flight must be on board. for watching Ayos Vlog. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Outro pa nga. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you guys on my next vlog. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel and thank you so much for watching.